Hello Aries, this is Bonnie from Soul Star Bliss with your June 2020 mini tarot reading. Let's take a shuffle here and see what's coming up for you. I am so excited. It's going to be summer here in the States. Oh, so anxious for that to get here. Please remember this is a general reading and if you'd like one just about you, I've included my website link down below. Feel free to, you know, click on that, get yourself an appointment set up and we'll get to it as quickly as we can. And also um, I've included the instant go if you just have a question or two. Um, it's pretty reasonable and we get to them as quickly there too as we can. And please remember to check your sun, your moon and your rising sign. So let's see what's coming up for you Aries. Oh my goodness, if this is... Pretty awesome. It looks like, you know, some of you that are single have had um, problems. I don't want to say picking the right mate, meeting the right person. And maybe you give too much before before you find out that's the one or not the one. So it just says in the, for new relationships, take your time. Enjoy what's going on. Learn the, about the other person. Learn about yourself because it says there's going to be opportunities for love for those of you that are single right now. And it says you never know who you're going to meet. It could be the one. So heads up with that. It says here too that take your time with other things. Take your time with getting to know people um, in general. And it says, you, you know, and, and I'm not telling you to be standoffish or anything else, but it seems like some of you um, are hiding part of yourself or you're not seeing the whole picture. Opportunities for work. Finally, finally, finally for some of you. Yes, yes, yes. It looks like it's a new beginning. And it may be it isn't full-time or maybe it isn't exactly what you want for pay but that will come it just seems like opportunities are going to present themselves in the financial area which would be work if you're selling something it could be a home or a boat or a car or whatever this could be a good month for that but it's also a month too where sometimes the sadness from the past can pop out um, you know or, or something that's drug you down is going to make you wonder is this how life is going to be it's just Sometimes all we have to do is change the way we look at things and open to receive, you know, abundance, joy, whatever it is that you're seeking. It says here, too, that um, some of you that are having financial trouble, that's going to change. And I think that has to do with the work or the money change that's coming for you. And then take advantage of that. Don't give your power away. Don't spend every $5 bill you get, for instance. Put one or two away because it'll be something's coming for you that you're going to be glad you have some extra money in a good way. I don't, I don't know if it's a vacation or something you want to buy, an opportunity. But, you know, do what you will. But it just says if you put a little extra money away, something is you're going to be happy about it. Let's put it that way. Wheel of Fortune says things are definitely going to get better for you. New opportunities will continue to present themselves. Oh, I love that. That's awesome uh, for a lot of you. And victory. It's gonna, you're going to feel like a victor. And when we feel like a victor, we act like a victor. And it says agreements, official agreements are made. So it looks like, I, I don't know if that's in personal life, could be for some, but I feel strongly about work that there's either been um, uh, a promotion or a job change or one's on the way for you, something that you're wanting in that area and you've worked hard for it. So open up to receive. Also the pregnancy card, which can mean abundance. If you want pregnancy, hallelujah. If you don't, know what to do. Sun card says joy definitely here. Journeys, okay, journeys, going from place to place. I'm not sure if that means for everybody, but it's almost like um, those of you that are seeking to move to a new place, it's possible, um, or you're going to have signs that it is. But also, if you, maybe this is about, I feel it might even be more about work. Some of you that have been waiting for travel at work or improvement at work. This could be a month where you're going to see where things do get better. Opportunities again will present themselves. Um, even though you feel like disappointment from the past, opportunities are going to come where you're going to have choices to make. Should I go? Should I stay? Should I go? Should I stay? You can choose that. You know, should I take the new job? Should I stay where I'm at? You're going to be just use your. Uh, intuition and, and be quiet and listen if you can because it says a lot of you are going to make opportunity choices and I don't think you're going to choose wrong I think you're going to be you're going to feel like a chariot one who's achieved greatness and you're going to feel like spirit has something to do with it there's going to be celebrations here for you so long overdue I'm so happy for you things finally seem like they're going to start falling into place don't be frightened so when we get frightened and we sit like this and don't know what to do and I do it myself sometimes that just we have to have a belief or see it. Believe we already have what we want or what we seek. 
and it says you deserve that you deserve great stuff it says you you're going to get what you deserve and usually when I say that to someone they go oh what have I done now this is in a good way it says changes that were made could be pretty permanent it's um you're going to feel like victory okay you might have been sitting around you were laid off from work or you didn't have a job or whatever it was that made you feel this way i just feel like for a lot of you you're going to say yes this is finally changing twos 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 changes 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 and it says what you've been waiting for make it happen you know what i mean you're going to have opportunities here step up and claim them for yourself aries yes this is really good your intuition very good this month um, as always, when you call on it, it really is. And it says the falling in place of uh, sequences or circumstances that bring you what you want. Oh, that is so awesome. So pay attention. If you're asking for a sign and you want one, good time to ask for that. If you're wanting things to be a certain way, you know, give it to spirit, trust, and then see what happens. And it says put your worries to rest, Aries. You're finally, a lot of you are going to feel like this month there's a turnaround for you. So with that blessing to you, uh, this is Bonnie from Soul Star Bliss. Thank you so much for dropping by. And if you really like what you saw, hit that subscribe button. I certainly appreciate, <laughs> appreciate each and every one of you. See you next month, Aries.